More and more employers are looking for workers with science and math skills and not just in traditional high tech fields. And as Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Mike Savino tells us tonight, the University of New Haven is among the colleges here that are trying to help more students get those skills. I have this American dream of settling down in New York. Sharath Raj came to the University of New Haven to live out his dream. He hopes his degree in business analytics will take him to the Big Apple. And he's taking advantage of a program seeking to bring more people into STEM, or science, technology, engineering, and math. International students who graduate from a STEM-designated program can stay in the U.S. for anywhere from 12 to 36 months for work and training. For us, we all know um, the universities in the United States are the best in the world. It's one of many ways that UNH is trying to get more women and people of color into STEM-related fields. The EDGE Scholars program launched earlier this year, and it seeks to get more high school students interested in STEM. I, as a woman, I've been in the business for a long, long time, but I am still a minority, let alone um, people of color. The labor market has changed with technology, and now employers in all kinds of fields, including finance and marketing, want potential hires who have a STEM education. UNH's business school also changed, adding STEM designations onto majors for businesses and marketing. On the undergraduate side in business analytics, we are one of a handful across the country that offers such a designation. That helps more students take advantage of the recruitment programs. UNH also helps students like Raj find jobs that they need to maintain their visas. Raj says that support helps him feel more welcome to pursue his dream. The fact is everybody here has an equal opportunity and like you know, America is a land of opportunity. From the University of New Haven, Mike Savino, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.